Oh, the Blackout's daughter. All right, guys, here we are to watch the trailer for The Black Coat's Daughter. Fuck is that movie? What? What the fuck is that? What do you mean? I feel like that's like the most, like, A, there's like so many girls in this trailer that oh, all okay, like look okay. like like enough alike where I'm like, what the fuck is happening? Everyone and looks like Emma Roberts now. That's that Emma Roberts is in this movie. That okay. That was Emma Roberts. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh yes. But this like aside from the fact that they're in like a girls' school and all yeah. wearing the same outfit no, and, they're at, and like uh, the plot just seems to jump around with like, like did you tell them the head was missing from the body and they had the DNA test to see if they were even related? You can't live in the school. Something, something, something. No, I'm choking you with a belt now. What's happening? I open a drawer. There's only sharp knives. <laughs> so they're Fuck. So they're like stuck at a boarding school for whatever reason. Like they can't get in touch with the, you know, their folks. They're obviously going to be like the sacrifices for the people in charge, who are like some sort of cult thing or whatever. And um, everyone's weird and acting weird, and it's good times. I don't know. I don't know what more uh, we need or whatever. This uh, is this is the trailer that would be on like a shitty DVD. I would watch called like you know. Uh, Snake with an appendaged arm, or like something. I'd be like, all right, and then there'd be a trailer like this before. And I'd be like, the fuck is that trailer? This is like a whole different type of horror movie. Yeah, but like, didn't like not a lot. A lot of these shots look beautiful. A lot it's of it's like this, a bad uh, thriller, though. It's not a horror movie. Okay, right. Yes, this is totally uh, most likely just humans uh, doing uh, bad things. I like anything where because it reminds me of like Return to Oz or like uh, a Girl Interrupted or something where, the, where like the people in charge versus the people and like the weird vibe of like the doctors and this, uh, this like old school thing like like there's a, doctors and shit. And it could right? just be the trailer. It could, <coughs> it could it could solely just be the trailer. But there's a yeah. thing that like bothers me when movies are like more about artsy shots than they are about content right. and that's what this this trailer is they're like yes. i'm like all right it's just you like you know showing me like this thing but like it's also a case where i believe you think you're artsier than you are because a lot of these shots i'm like you are, yeah, i'm uh, like yes that's technically an artsy shot but i'm like it's also like kind of grainy and like not like awesome I'm you, like, eh. you resent this, uh, you, you know, uh, pretentiousness that you're picking yes. up. Yes, and it, it, okay. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm alone in picking this up. It just it seems yeah, like I, uh, do, I don't know if that's the movie or, or 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 the trailer though, like you're saying. Exactly, because this was something that usually the person the who makes the movie does not cut the trailer, so yeah. this could just be like, eh. but it just I'm like, who well, is the main so character? Like the main character is clearly this girl with. The face, this girl. It has Dexter's dad in it. I like him. That's who. I'm like, uh, there's a bunch of like semi familiar faces I was seeing. Um, I'm so bad with that. The very end of the trailer is what looks like a scene from, you know, from the movie. Uh -huh. And I was sort of like, uh, you know, like I said, I kind of like, you know, weird time periods and like weird, like old school nun doctor creepy like shock therapy weird like that sort of vibe uh -huh. so like i was i was interested this last conversation i don't know what to feel about it it, it kind of like i'm overall i'm kind of creeped out by this trailer and i'm interested to see like what happens i think that i'll be disappointed once i know <laughs> but like at the moment like it all colors the, me disappointed the flow of the last conversation was so weird and so creepy you were smiling um, a little was something funny and she goes what like funny no, uh, there's a lot of like long pauses and weirdness, and I wonder if the whole movie's like that, and if that will be like. This it, looks like. Did you see let the le something. let the right yeah. one in? No, I wanted to though. Obviously, um, I want to see everybody. This looks like the same film quality of the first one, but that was a good movie, and this is not. What does that mean exactly? Like, if if I took shots from this and shots from that, I think I could put them together, and you wouldn't know which and movie would I was watching. Oh, yeah. cool! Like that same like. I'm like, much more interested in seeing let the right one in then. <laughs> Like it just I, I don't know it it it's uh like the muted tones that they pulled the reds out like yeah I don't know it this is not doing it for me um you seem to be more intrigued yeah, than I stuff. but I give this uh, a thumbs down I would thumbs this up just to okay so I'm I'm very concerned one of these title cards that erotically pops up charged says erotically charged and fraught with menace and that makes me go mm, I don't know why you would say that and then, like the rest of this trailer doesn't make sense with that at all it's really weird. Yeah. So there might be some weird shit in here. I like weird shit. I don't know. Uh, I want to see this. I, I will thumbs this up. I will assume you will never see this movie, though. I will never see this movie.